ladies and gentlemen, it's Desiree. I am here. Where did I put those? Oh, there they are. I'm going, where did I put the foxes? I was doing something this morning on my table because I spent today um, getting a whole bunch of stuff cleaned up. So, while I'm booting up the computer and getting everything set up today, I would like to know if you were granted three wishes, what would they be? You know what? That wasn't the one I meant to put up there. Oh, man. Really? really? That was not the question. That was not today's question. Today's question is... When you're having a bad day, what do you do to make yourself feel better? That's the question. Sorry. I'm eating cookies. Not because I'm having a bad day, though. Because I'm not having a bad day. But I am eating cookies. Because I am celebrating. We have a new team member. I have a new team member on the Easy Crafters um, team, Chocolate Tour team. Her name is Melissa. Um, those of you in the craft room saw me. Congratulate her also here on the page. So everybody, let's give it up for Melissa and congratulate her on starting her journey. So here I am. I have milk and cookies, milk and cookies, sorry, it's rude to eat and talk, but I gotta finish my cookie. And I got my milk, that makes me happy, that always makes me feel better, although you know, these are peanut butter cookies, and for some reason, um, they're coming from the store. They seem, I don't know what they do to these cookies, but they're not, they don't taste like peanut butter cookies like when I was young and we made them. It just doesn't taste that way. But, I'm still going to eat it. Here's to having milk and cookies when you don't feel good. I actually feel fine, but I felt like having milk and cookies. So, I am an adult. I live alone. I make that decision. <laughs> so I am. Um, but today, what I have, besides having had um, my foxes from the other day that I did, never did put away. I got them all cleaned up and then put them away. And I do need to put them away. Pull that off. One last bite and I'll be done. I swear. A little more milk and I'm done. And that is celebrating Melissa joining the team. Um, hopefully we can all congratulate her and wish her well on her truck tour journey. She will be getting um, a 15% coupon to use as a one-time addition to the 40% that she will be getting off. So she will have a one-time 55% off. So it's cool. Um, plus, she's going to enjoy that 40% off all of the Chuck Couture stock. And I'm going to send her a little welcome to the team this week sometime. But let me, let me finish off my milk because I have... I have some stuff. This 
is the, um, I know what this is. This is going to be um, my, I know I'm like hiding behind it, but this is what I got um, from the vault launch. So first off, I'm going to go over here and I'm going to clip down here because these big giant envelopes, you know, I had one of the uh, guys that deliver this, he asked me, what is in those giant envelopes? I'm like, uh, chocolate tour? And so they're silk screen transfers that I use for my Facebook lives and that I sell. Let's see if I can, I feel like that'd be able to, maybe I can just pull this side. <laughs> Did not come. It ripped off. That's okay. I am going to that. Let's see if I can. It's not going to come off. They really taped that one up pretty good this time. So. I'm going to use these old scissors. They're not fabric scissors. They're not fabric scissors. After this, they will definitely need sharpening. There we go. I got it open. So let's see. Here is the Christmas transfer. This is the Santa Claus transfer. Of course, they're sold out. I, I, you know, they sold out those on the first day. Let me see what else I got in here. Okay, these, I got these and these. These sold out on the first day. I don't do mornings rise and shine. Good morning. This this is one of the first transfers I ever got. Um, I have it somewhere. I'm not sure where I put it because I've stored away things that retired. But yeah, these and those. And then I have some more in here. Oh, I bent the edge. But I have the Happy New Year, uh, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year transfers. These are the large ones. This is actually, uh, oops, wrong way. This sign right here. That is that sign. That was an hour and a half that I did to work on this project. So, just so you know. And then we have, oops, almost knocked my milk on my laptop, that would be good. Darling, the one thing that you, that you have that nobody else is you, your voice, your mind, your story, your vision, your heart, your soul. So laugh and sing, dance and play, write and draw, create and build. Um, love and shine. Stay true to yourself. Embrace your inner beauty and remember to live life as only you can. So yes, these are all things. I think the only one that hasn't sold out now is this sign. And it, I, you know what? It could have already sold out because um, the vault, when it opens, it's become so popular. You guys, I can't tell you enough how popular that vault has become. Um, we're starting to see people going and getting these transfers and then reselling them on eBay for way more than we can sell them for. So I can't, you know, go and list them for more than the retail price. So that's just, you know, 
it, it's good and it's bad. I don't like seeing um, transfers get put out there at a price that um, most people can't afford or would want to. But they are here, and I intend to do something with them in the Easy Crafters craft room. So if you are not in the Easy Crafters craft room, it behooves you to get in there. Um, one of them may not go there. Uh, something may go somewhere else to someone else. And I'm going to put these all back in here so that they're safe. I'm going to put them in here. I think maybe not. This is going to take a while to get them. My dog hears me and she's going, what are you doing in there? So if you're out there while I'm putting these away, what I want to know is what do you do, you know, if you're having a bad day or something's happening, what do you do to make yourself feel better? For me, the obvious, I craft. I go ahead and do some crafts and make some things, which what I'm going to make. I didn't make a plan. You know, that's something sometimes I don't do. I don't make the plan and then I don't know what I want to do. If that makes sense. I don't know if that makes sense. It probably doesn't. It probably doesn't. I have some projects coming. up here will work. I think I'm going to go do this project on something, um, but I also let's see what we're gonna do here. Let me. I, I need to finish my milk. So, make sure you say hello. Hey, there you are. There's Tabitha. Craft and jam to music or you clean. You know, sometimes if I'm really feeling bad, I start cleaning and it keeps my mind busy. And it keeps me off whatever's really making me feel out of sorts. I have to finish this, you guys, because if I put this anywhere, Lewis the cat will be up on wherever it's at, and he will knock it over. Um, that's how he messed up my work laptop. Hi, Amanda. How are you? There we go. I finished it. Let me go put this over here. And we need to grab something. We need to grab some kind of a surface for this. I don't want to take this off because I have our... <laughs> that was a long project. I don't want to take it off. We're just going to leave that there. Uh, t-shirt. Well, we make t-shirts all the time. So I don't think so. Oh, you know what? I got one of these. I got one of these. It's a little bit small, but I think we can make it work. But I'm going to do, what I'm going to do first is grab, where did my markers go? I need my markers. There they are. Yay, I got my markers. I found them. I know. 
the cap is coming off of it, but we're going to do, this is something that, um, you know, I've seen them do the, the whole, here, let me see, I need a, another, this other lightning, I forgot to turn that on. Um, I have seen, you know, and I've demonstrated where you put it on the plastic bag and smoosh it all around, but we did something different. Uh, last time. So I'm going to do that different thing. We're going to go like this. This is just a water washable marker. I'm just going to go right on top of this. Then I'm going to spray it with water. Isn't that cool? Look at that. It's, ooh. Look at that. Push it, push it, push it, push it, push it. Oh. Do you guys see that? Have you guys seen the pores? This is a... Guess what I did, you guys? Guess what I did? I came up with another thing. Didn't I? This is acrylic pouring without acrylics. Or epoxy or any of that stuff. Because, you know. I did. I did a thing. Um, let me turn the air conditioner off and something else off in here so that I can actually um, use the thing and not, you know, shut down the power again. Oops. Been there, done that, haven't I? I have done that um, multiple times. And you guys, we won't talk about how many times I've done that because... Des has done that uh, more than once. So, I'm going to go ahead and dry this. get it dry. Can, can you ever spray too much water? Um, depends on what you're spraying it on. You know? I mean, this, this was purely by accident, you guys. I wasn't planning this, but hey, that's the way it works. When I go on YouTube, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to rename this video. So renaming this video. You're making planner stickers and a birthday card, Tabitha. That's awesome. That is so awesome. You know what? I don't like that. I'm gonna spread it over the top of that. It didn't get over here either. So. I'm going to go over there. And dry it. 
to get this all dry. And then I'm going to do some more color because I still don't like the way that's turning out. color and I'll do another color right after it because I want more than one color. So you guys, what color should I pick to go with this? We got green. I, You know, I've got a whole bunch of colors. I'm going to move this to the side so I can pour these colors out and you guys can kind of look at what you think. Oops, someone went off the side. Oh well. So which color do you think would look good with this color? The green? I kind of like that green. That green would look good on there. Um, purples, the red. You have the orange as well. So what color? All right. I think that's dry. That's pretty dry. Look at that, you guys. So, what color? What color should I put on there? I'm leaning towards green, um, but, you know, purple could look good with it. Uh, the orange could look good. We have a light blue, but I think that would fade. Um, and then there's, what color is this? I'm trying to see, it doesn't really say what color it is, but there's this color right there. So what color do you think would work with it? I'm gonna turn that other light back on. And the air conditioner because, oh my gosh, it's hot. I know it's loud, but it's hot. You guys. I'll turn it off again afterwards. So, any picks on color? Anybody? Or I'm just gonna pick one. Okay, since you guys are being real quiet, I'm gonna pick a color. I think there was, that was another yellow. I'm not really feeling yellow. So, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna spin this around, and I'm just gonna go add. This green, we'll add that green. And just kind of get it to spread. So it doesn't look like lines anymore. And look, the blue is lifting again. I think what we'll do is we'll just slide it or let it slide around the way 
they do with the, the other stuff. Just like this. For purple so we're not getting the purple today maybe tomorrow and then of course now that I've done this and I'm going to um, stick with this color uh, now I have to you know purple would have looked good purple would have because it would have been a, a darker color but let me go ahead you know what I'm gonna smear that around because I want it to be smeared. So we're going to kind of go like that and see if I can get it to cover that edge. Like that. And this was all by mistake, you know. I know I'm going to have to clean that up in that corner because it's not enough. Here. Let me turn off the air conditioner. Green was, it was, wasn't it? I like the green. I should have named this. I, you know, I, I can't even explain to you guys. Sometimes these things come up and I'm like, oh, wait, I could do that. And then it becomes, because uh, I don't think I've ever seen anybody do this. So we're going to go dry it all off. I'm going to go high this time because it's it wiped off a lot of that color. So I think we will do put some more blue on it. So I'm just going to go high because I don't want it to push the color so much as dry the color. Because a lot of that color slid off. Remember, this is an experiment. What should we call this? Since you guys are watching me. And I, this is the first time I've ever done this, and I have never seen anybody else do something quite like this. Um, let me ask you guys, what should we call it? I was thinking, you know, marker pour, because it's kind of like the paint pouring. But what should we call it? thinking marker pour but that might not be what we want to call it <laughs> so you guys help me out since you're the one the first witnesses uh tell me what you think i should call it and i'm just going to go ahead and go over it with all three of the colors this time and we're gonna see what happens i know i'm being you know total non-chalk couture thing here but this is my project 
So I'm just trying to get some color down on here. I'm going to get some more blue. We're going to see what happens. And put a lot of green. I think I'm going to put more green on it than I did before. And we're going to see what happens. I'm kind of excited about this. I, I am. Because, you know, it's fun to make stuff up and invent stuff. It really is. Now, here's the key. This is a mister. So it is just misting over the top of this. I don't know how well you would get this done if you were to use like a regular squirt bottle. But look at that, you guys, look at that. So let's slide it around, let it slide and slide. Let it slide this way, all the way to the edge. And then we're going to go back this way. And then down here. Look at that. Is this not awesome? I know I had to have it all up all the way on the edge, but yeah, that I think this is it. I'm going to dry it and then we're going to put the transfer on it. and dry. Look at that color. And you know what, you guys, this is going to go into, this project is a project that I am going to put into an auction that we are running for my, uh, for projects for everybody on the team. So we, that's the Chocotour team, Melissa included, our new designer, newest designer. She, any projects she makes, she can include there. Because she's already got the full invite, so as soon as she gets her project materials, she gets to be in it and sell her stuff. Lewis, get down from, oh, bad cat. You guys know what he did? 
Can you anybody guess what Lewis went and did? Because it's Lewis Kitty. So Lewis Kitty has gone over there and knocked that glass down. Betty, these are, um, they're just washable markers. They're just washable markers that I used. And this is just a regular canvas. Um, I can't remember where I got it. I think I got it at Walmart, but I'm not sure. I could have got it online. It, they, they came in a pack. That's all I can tell you. They came in a pack of, uh, Six. I think I got it at Walmart. If I don't remember. So thinking. Oh, what am I making? What am I making? I am making a project. Still thinking. I don't know who still thinking is, but. Uh, just whatever comes to mind is what I make usually most nights. So as soon as this is dry, I will move on to the next step. Because this is just the background. To the next step. There we go. It's kind of, you know, it's kind of like the, the paint pours that they're doing. But we still get some sharp edges because we do the dry. Now, I think if I were just to leave this to dry overnight, it would make a different impression. I wouldn't get the lines that I'm getting here from the drying process, but I'm kind of in a hurry. I know, it's like, why are you in a hurry? So we're gonna put this transfer over the top. Now, the thing is to bear in mind, but it doesn't all fit. So the T, I think the T is gonna get cut off some. And here comes Lewis the cat who went and knocked over the cup because he thinks he's gonna get milk, and no, I don't give kitties milk. Yes, I am streaming on multiple platforms, so I think that it's telling me you're still thinking if um, you're on one of the other platforms. The Facebook people are coming through, so you're either on YouTube or Periscope. So those are the other two platforms that I am streaming to. So yes, I do stream to multiple platforms. If you're on YouTube, give it a like. Oops. I got one little spot there that did it dry. Come on, dry, dry, dry. Get it, get it, get it. <laughs> got it. All righty. There, it's dry. So I'm gonna put this transfer over the top. Now these transfers, they have an adhesive and there's a backing, which I'm gonna write, where's my marker? Not these markers, uh, cause those are washable. That's not gonna stay. Well, apparently I'm not gonna write on the back today. Usually I write on the back, so I know the back. And this is a silk screen. These transfers are reusable eight to 12 times. More if you take care of them, and even more if you know some secret that we know, <laughs> that I know. Uh, Cause I usually, if I have never, actually there have been a couple of transfers that I have thrown away um, because I just, one couldn't be bothered or they got crumpled be, or, the other one would be the kitties, got it. Because <sighs> the kitties. Okay, 
So, put this on here. Next up is a paste. And I'm looking over here at my pastes. And we could do black or, oh, 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 I know what to do. I know what to do. Yeah, there's, there's the harvest. The shimmer harvest would look really cool on it. But, hey, darling, I'm also thinking that we could use shimmer frost. Or not frost, um, shimmer shadow. Because that's a pretty color, too. And I think it will show up better. See this? See, 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 see? See if it'll... Do you guys see? There it is. There's the shimmer. So, I'm going to put this on here. This will be the last part of this. So, here we go. Right over the top. I'm going to let it go all the way to the edge. Just like this. Just like that. And coming across here. And here it goes. And you guys remember the question of the night. The question of the night is, if you're having a bad day, what do you do to make yourself feel better? What do you do to make yourself feel better? Me, I like to craft. It's my happy place. It makes me feel better coming in here and crafting. Because my dull day job, you guys, is super, super stressful. Let me just put it that way. It is a super stressful. Okay. And I'm going to put this over here. Close this up. The, the product, this is Chalk Couture. Um, and I am a Chalk Couture independent designer. My name is Desiree. And if you want more information, I can um, send you stuff. Just tell me uh, where you're coming from. Okay, this right here, this transfer, I'm going to wash it off in the sink. I'll do that afterwards because this is only chalk paste. So the chalk paste isn't going to be a problem if it dries in there. It's only when I use the ink and I'm doing it on other stuff. But here we go. Check it out. Together they built a life they loved. And that came from a plain white canvas that I used. A new technique that got invented tonight as we were speaking. Um, using washable markers and water. And then I just put this over the top of it. So... That is super, I'm gonna have to practice with that. <laughs> See or talk to your grandbabies. Yeah, you know what, Betty? My granddaughter, she can make me smile just like that. Just like that, especially when she laughs. She's six years old now, so she's really into playing with her friends now, but she does still like to come to grandma's and we go, we, we're, I have to arrange another grandbaby date. So right now our grandbaby dates is we go to Baskin Robbins and we get ice cream. She loves that. I love doing that for her too. So you've never heard of it before. Um, it's been around for three years. Uh, let me see if I have the link here. Uh, let's see. Let me see. Well, 
This is the link, crafter.news forward slash club. It's a, a URL redirect. I'm going to be quite honest with you, but it's easier to remember than blah, 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 blah. But that takes you to the Club Couture. Now, the Club Couture is uh, just a monthly club. And this, this particular project right here, I'm going to put it over here. That particular project is from last month, from July. So Club Couture, what that does is that gets you one 8x10 transfer every month for $19.99. Shipping is free. You get a squeegee. You get two paste singles. And you can do multiple projects with this. So this was um, last month's project. And I just did this one night. This right here, we can mix the pastes and the inks. I do all kinds of stuff. This project is using ink. This project right here. We have T-shirt Tuesday. And of course, <laughs> as I'm speaking, you know what? The laptop over here just shut down because it's going, I hate you. I swear it does. But that's Club Couture. That will get you crafter.news forward slash club will get you there and let me see uh no 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 i did not set up a link for it i am sorry um i do have things that you can do if you were in facebook but that's okay uh let's see the try me kits are all sold out right now so i'm not gonna put that up Let's get this back because restream. There we go. I'm back. Look, I, I might be able to see you guys again. But this laptop that I have over here, this thing, it overheats really quickly. I think I need to get something to cool it down. I, you know, I should because this is my dull day job is with computers. So yeah, these, these projects are easy to do. Um, everything you see back here are projects I've done. I don't know if you guys can see this one. That was from a project. I'll take that off. Uh, oh, I almost forgot. Our last live. Our last live was this like, cute little thing. Come on, there. So this cute little thing was done on the last live. So many things, so many things. But I'm glad you guys had a chance to come and watch and you caught it live. I made up something new. Um, I think next T-shirt Tuesday, I should do a tie-dye um, mix with the wet T-shirt technique. What do you guys think? You only use Twitter? I I will pick you up on Twitter. I, I do have Twitter. This goes out to Periscope, which is where you're seeing it from Twitter. So I will swing by on Twitter and check um, your comments on that particular uh, video. Because Twitter is one of my other avenues. So I have a multi-stream. It goes Facebook, YouTube, Periscope, Periscope. And I didn't know this when I started. Periscope drops it onto Twitter. So if you're on Twitter, not a problem. I'll come by and say hello. So yeah. Uh, and those people who join my team, guess what? If they want to learn how to do this, I am more than happy to help. Um, and get you set up to do something like this if you would like to uh, be on Chaka Tour and go live with projects. Lots of neat things here. So with that said, I'm going to say good night. I have a 3 a.m. wake up call for the dull day job tomorrow because I have to watch some servers. But you guys have a great evening. Again, everybody, yay for Melissa becoming a new team member. Yay, Melissa. I am so glad she's on. And we are looking forward to lots of great things for her. Good night.